live look over Jacksonville Beach, and right here you can see lifeguards patrolling the beach area. In fact, uh, Action News Jack's Ben Becker is picking up our live team coverage along the shoreline. Ben, when we saw you about a half an hour ago, you had the lifeguards right behind you, telling, making sure people stay out of the water. And over your left shoulder, Ben, I see a surfer. Yeah, John, that's right. You have great eyesight. Take a look behind me. You can see this guy coming in from the water right now. Not recommend that you do that. We have double red flags. And here he comes out of the water. Take a walk up here. Come follow me a little bit. So you can see these huge breakers are coming in. Again, this isn't a whole lot right now because you know we're waiting Dorian to make its move towards the Florida coast. And this is something that certainly uh, is going to get worse and worse as as the day moves on into the night. How you doing? Yeah. How's the surf out there? It's all right. You know, it's fun. It's just a little blown out still. Yeah, I'm being told it's like a washing machine out there. Yeah, there's a couple good ones still. It's kind of petering out. There's no lines to it. Not the best conditions? Yeah, it could be better. We're hoping for a little on Thursday when the wind dies down. So. We'll now, see. now, you know you're not supposed to be out there. Oh, uh, you know. They warn you, but... You know, everyone knows now, right? I've been surfing for long enough. I've lifeguarded for four years, so... So you feel like, at least for you, you can handle it? I'm comfortable out there. But not other people? Yeah, I wouldn't recommend swimming out there. You know, you want to have something to float you, at least. All right, stay safe. Make yeah. the right choice. So, yeah. there you go. He just came in right from the water, as you saw right here live on CBS 47, Fox 30, Action News Jax. Uh, he uh, enjoying himself, but again, we're not recommending that. You're not supposed to be out here. Matter of fact, there's a lot of people out here. Take a look over to my left. A lot of people here, mandatory evacuations, not supposed to be on the beach, not supposed to be in the water yet. That is the case. I just reached out to uh, Jack's Beach, uh, the Jack's Beach Police Department. I want to kind of get a clarification from them as to like what's being done to enforce anything out here. Because all I've seen so far is is Ocean Rescue warning people to not go on the water, but that's been the extent of it. I haven't seen any police officers or anything like that telling people not to go in the water or enforcing uh, the mandatory evacuation. So I'm going to reach out to them uh, after this and find out exactly what they're going to do if anything. Uh, certainly, they can't throw all these people in jail, but there has to be some uh, recourse that they may be looking into. Anyway, that's something I'll be working on. I'll have that for you later. Reporting live from Jack's Beach, Ben Becker, CBS 47, Fox 30, Action News, Jacks.